Hey guys, what's up? Okay, I'm back to do our favorite topic and that's about water bottles. I'm just gonna start off with like, if you don't get it, just turn it off right now. Just stop, don't even watch it. Like, honestly, I cannot take people who are triggered by stupid shit. Like, legitimately, like I said in my last video, if you're going to be triggered enough to leave a comment or have an opinion about this so deeply, you need to just lock yourself in a closet and never come out again. You will legitimately might as well quit life now, okay? Let me do my video without you talking about saving the planet, reusable fucking tumblers that I don't fucking like and I don't have to like them, okay? It's not the vibe, just stop. It's not the fucking vibe. If you wanna go do a vibe, your own vibe about other things, then do it. Leave me alone, I don't fucking care and you're fucking killing the vibe, okay? Number one. Number two, I'm gonna mention probably so many times in this video how I don't fucking like water. And it's true. Like, I don't drink water, actually. I drink Diet Coke. Like, I don't give a fuck. Shut up, okay? Just stop. Yes, I do drink Diet Coke, okay? I'm not thirsty for water. I don't know what it is. Like, I only drink water. Like, if I have Mexican food, like, I get fucking parched as fuck and, like, have to, like, wake up in the middle of the night and drink, and drink water. Or if I'm, like, hungover. Like, I swear to God, like, I don't drink water. I don't know what it is. Um... So I don't even like love water. I don't know, it's the weirdest thing. Okay, also like just, just stop. Like if I say that, I'm just, I can just imagine these people out there getting so worked up about this video and it's just embarrassing. Stop it, leave me the fuck alone, okay? I just wanna do a small, like a little intro about it because this is gonna be like triggering for people out there who have nothing better to do. Like I can't even imagine like having the time to sit and watch a video who I, and like write a comment like I didn't agree. Like, oh my God. I, I legitimately have four million things to do. Okay, so I'm gonna start off. I have like this whole plethora of water bottles here. And the, I'm just gonna start off by saying like, if you get it, you get it. If you don't, you don't. If you know, you know. And if you don't know, like I honestly feel bad for you. Like I, I cannot explain it. Like I don't have the vocabulary to sit here and explain it. Like either you get the vibe or you don't get the vibe. I'm also really irritated with these water companies, a lot of these water companies, my hair is like really ugly right here. It's like fucking bother me as fuck right now. Um, okay, I'm, I'm just gonna like say something I'm bothered, bothered about. These water companies have the ability to make beautiful water bottles, aesthetically pleasing water bottles, water bottles that I would buy, yet they produce the ugliest shit ever. Like they have the money. It's like they have the money. Like, who the fuck designed this shit? Get fucking get a refund. Like, it bothers me. Like, I don't know. Literally, legitimately, like, why are there no 70s vibe water bottles? Like, why is there no, like, minimal cool water bottles? Like, um, not even, like, try okay, just stop. <sighs> okay, I'm just gonna insert this right here because I forgot to talk about my new bracelet and I was, like, too busy ranting to say anything, but obviously the water is gonna continue after this. Okay, let me just show it to you. It's so cute. It's called the 90s bracelet glow up, and if you know what I mean, then I'll have to explain it, but do you remember? in like the 90s, how we all had these bracelets with our names on them that we made. Well, I made these with real pearls, real like white, beautiful, you can't tell here, I don't know, they're really pretty iridescent pearls, um, real ones. And then you can choose, this says HRH because I love my company, obviously, um, but you can choose anything you want, um, any name. So you just like in the notes section at checkout, you just leave what name you want and any specifications that you want. But I wanted to share that with you. It's so cute. I love it with the real pearls. Because I see these everywhere now, but they're still with like beads and stuff. And I don't want to wear like beads. I feel like it's like too like junky looking. And this is like something really nice and real, but fun. So I'm really excited about that. I love it. Um, that And then I'm wearing my Mignon Choker, of course. And then you guys know Studio 54 is also, what I want to tell you real quick is, you know the, um, those new earrings? I'm not wearing them now because I'm wearing a lot of necklaces and rings and stuff. Um, this is new too. I have um, new bougie watch band rings and then my lion and my chain rings. You guys know that. Okay, really quick about the earrings. So um, those earrings that I wore in my last video, I had them at like a special intro price and they are going to like go up to their normal price probably starting like on Monday. So if you wanted some of those earrings, definitely get them this week because I think you're saving like Five dollars on one on one earring, then ten dollars on a set. So it's a really really good savings. Okay, all right. Honestly, I'm pissed. I'm just gonna go through these. There are so many things I'm pissed about. Nothing is pretty much nothing is good. Everything has a problem. I'm sick of it. We will get through it. Like and you know, you'll see. I, after after I go through this, a lot of people like send me water bottles. Like, oh my god, Alex, what do you think about this one? And like sometimes I like really feel bad because like I don't want to respond because like no, it's not the vibe. Like it's actually like too try hard. Or I'll be like yeah, like whatever. Just like ugh. okay. So here we go. 
I'm like fucking, my phone is like blowing up. I'm already exhausted. Actually, I'm, actually I drink coffee too. Like, I don't even want to drink water. I just... Okay, right, here we go. I'm fucking annoyed right now. I'm just like really irritated. Here we go. I'm just gonna pick up one. Should I pick one that I like first? I'm just gonna pick up one that's like, I don't know. Here we go. Okay. I'll just pick up a classic. Okay, this is a classic water bottle, Evian. And if you notice about this bottle, it's like the vintage -y one, okay? Like it still has those vintage -y original, like when did Evian start? Like 60s, 70s? I don't even fucking know, probably 40s. Oh, who fucking knows? Um, I love Evian bottles. I hate the new ones. The ones, I couldn't find it. Like I don't want to purchase it anyway. Like I'm actually pissed that I had to purchase ugly water bottles. Like I seriously like am so mad about it. I might even just like return them because like I don't even want them in my house. Like and I don't want them to like, like reorder them. I don't want like the, like the store to reorder them because they're shit. Like no, like order, oh my God. Like I need to like be the buyer for every single fucking establishment on the face of the planet. Okay, so this, I love it. It's like the, it's like the vintage one. You know, like the new ones that are plain. There's no glacier on it and there's no, like, um, it's like printed on the bottle. It's just like Evian, it's like really like minimal and there's no like mountains and there's no pink. Like, it's just ugly. You guys know what I'm talking about, right? It's fucking ugly. So I found this one, which it's like a newish version, but there's like an ugly minimal version I fucking hate. It's just like they phoned it in. It's like they bought a generic water bottle. They put their like signature blue top on it and then they just like printed Evian on the front. It's like the rudest thing I've ever seen in my life. Like, have some more, like, pride in your in your water bottle for real. Like, okay. To be honest, I want to. I'm gonna try these with you. Evian, I already know. I don't even want to say it. It's so disgusting. I'm not gonna say what it tastes like because you're gonna like a lot of people out there. This is like this is not a family show, obviously. And you guys are like just really. Oh, I can't say it. It's like okay. I'm gonna. I might say it. I hate this water. Like if even if I parch as fuck, like it's hard to drink. Oh my God, it's like salty. Okay, I'm just gonna leave it at that. What is like a disgusting thing that's like... Okay, sorry, of course my like memory card got full right when I was going through my description of the water. Okay, it's just what, like, what is it that tastes salty and like thick? It's like too, it's too thick for water. Like, I don't know why this has a taste but every time I drink it, it reminds me of something absolutely fucking disgusting. Like, not that I would know, to be honest. Like, I can't. Like, it's, it legitimate, it has like a salt water taste almost to it. Like, not ocean water, but it's like, they put like a hint of salt in it. I, I don't, I don't fucking know, but I've never liked Evian. Like, I, I only like it because the packaging is pretty. My hair looks like a fucking mess right now. Like, what in the actual fuck? Okay. Um, all right, next one I'm going to talk about is our is our Chanel water. I do love, still love the Chanel water. I think it's really cute. Okay, let me go back and I'm going to say one more thing about this, about this water. The thing is that if I was ever going to have, like, a dinner party at my house or, like, you know, like, sit outside on my, like, my backyard and my patio set and have, like, people over, which I never will because, like, I just don't. I'm not, like, an entertainer. Like, I am not good at small talk. Like, I don't like guests over at my house. I don't really like to attend things with, like, guests because I don't like to talk. Like, I'm deaf in my left ear. So I can't hear anything when there's like multiple people around. It's too, like, I just, I would rather not, like, I'd rather set up my party for myself. Like, me and, like, I don't know, one other person. And, not really. Just me and, me and, like, Ming, to be honest. And, like, make a nice dinner and, like, set up for myself. Like, I don't, I don't want to, like, more, I don't, like, talk to anyone. Like, just the thought of, like, having to speak to people and, like, bring up conversations. Like, I don't, I just, like, I, like, saw stuff that in my tracks. Like, I just don't want to do it. So, but this is like the, if you like, if you guys like to entertain, which like the, the whole population loves to entertain. I know I'm like the fucking anomaly. Um, this is a water bottle to put out. Like this is cute. This is like seventies. Like, I don't know. It's like classic. It's like, you like, it's your, you're like bougie person. Like you're bougie, like you're bougie, but you're not like a fucking, like, like a psychotic snob. You're also like probably Scandinavian-y. I don't know, which I love. I like, love like Swedish stuff you guys know like I'm whatever my dad's Swedish like I like is it Swedish no that's <laughs> French okay whatever yeah like French people too okay so here we go next thing when you talk about the Chanel bottle so I still love the Chanel bottle I think it's really cute um I, I just I love it I feel like this is what I feel about the Chanel water I, the, the it tastes good too except um I like to get water that I can share with Ming and like I used to be able to share with Bao and Chow but I don't think that they can drink this because it's like I don't know I'm not sure 
So I get other water for them, but or for her, she's not bow and shower. Unfortunately, not with us anymore. Okay, so um, this water, I just actually love this size. This is very cute. This looks like I just worked out. Like, I don't know. It's kind of like a little bit try hard. I'm gonna get into the try hard ones, and you'll see what I'm talking about. But this one is cute. This is like this kind. Okay, this doesn't bother me. If I saw someone walking around with this water bottle, it wouldn't bother me. Like, I wouldn't want to punch them out. Like, it, it's fine. It's a little expensive. It's like a little bit like you're trying to be that extra person, which I hate. Like I hate someone who like deliberately walks around and tries to be extra with like a water bottle. Like, fish stop, please. Oh my god. Okay, now it kind of has a filtered water taste, which I hate. Oh my god. Like my parents, I go to my parents' house and they have like this filtered tap water in their sink. They have like the regular sink water and they have the filtered tap water, and the filtered tap water tastes so sparklessy. You know what I mean? Those sparklets have that fucking taste. I can't stand it. Like, every time I, own the, I go over there, I'm like, search in their house for a water bottle. They, like, don't buy water bottles. So I, like, end up being fucking parched at their house. I don't know why I'm, like, looking for water at their house. Why? Oh, my God. I'm like, dying for water at my parents' house. I hate water. Okay. So, I don't know. I love this. It's a really cute size. I nothing to say about it. Yeah, it's the Chanel, Chanel water bottle. If you, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm not going to explain it. That means that you haven't, like, watched the first video. I will try and put the the video below, I will not try, I will link the video for my first water bottle um, thing below. And um, yeah, okay, so that one, oh, my nose is itching. You guys know I don't edit this shit, so just deal with me. I have really bad allergies. No, I'm not a fucking cook, shut up, so stupid. I'm not at anything. So fucking irritated people. Okay, next one I talk about is, um, I'm just gonna reach. So this is the one I always have at home um, it's, oh, it's why it's cold. I like have it in my fridge. This is the Hawaiian water bottle. I absolutely love the color. It tastes really good and the shape is pretty. I feel like they put thought into their shape. It just looks nice. Like it just, it's, it's it reminds me of a vacation. The color is pretty Hawaiian. It's like very, I don't know. I just love it. I think I just love this. I love it. The only thing is there's big fucking hairy, like sea anemone on the front. They used to have a really pretty plumeria or something on the front that was so gorgeous. What the fuck is, it's like a bloody looking sea anemone. It looks like a fucking disgusting, I don't know what it is. I don't get it. They won't change it. It's so fucking ugly. It ruins the whole vibe. It's honestly a little bit embarrassing. Like I would never put this on my dinner table. If there's people coming over, it's like, what is this big hairy like sea anemone like staring me in the face? Like it's just so gross. Honestly, I really hate them for doing that. It's so horrible, but I'm not going to open it because I love the taste of this. This is what I have in my house. They're usually expensive, like almost $3 a piece, but there's a, a grocery store near my house that sell, has them for only 79 cents a piece. Like it's amazing deal. So I always get them or else I probably wouldn't. Um, I'm just like, don't, I don't know. I don't know. Cause like, I like to share things with like the dog too. And like, she actually drinks water. So, okay. Um, next one I'm gonna talk about, I'm already exhausted for this. I'm like really tired right now. Oh my God, like, I exhausted myself. I get like really worked up about this shit. Okay. I'm going to talk about this. Oh my God. I just came across this Whistler fucking water. No, I knew there was this and I've purchased it before, but did I know about the sippy top? You guys know I love a fucking sippy top. Like it is everything. I, the, the, I, the, ugh. I have to open this up. First of all, I'm like trying to walk somewhere. Like I have my dog. I have like my keys, my bag. Like now I'm going to open this up and like, what the fuck am I going to do with this stupid fucking top? Like get out of my face. Stop. Like it's so annoying. This is so convenient, easy. I love it. Like, I just, it's, I just love it. I love it. It's so 90s. Like, isn't this like so 90s? Like the cutest water bottle. Like, this is like so 90s. Do we not remember this? Okay. So it's just very cute. I love Whistler. It's like my favorite place to ski in the whole world. Best snow, best mountain. Love it. If you want to go skiing, I vote Whistler. Um, I love the, I just love it. It's very like 90s, but with like a modern edge to it. And very impressed. Okay. So let me take a sip. Oh yeah, tastes like a vacation. I'm not fucking kidding. Do you know when you like go to another country and the water tastes different, like but but good? It just tastes. It just doesn't taste like it's from here. I love it. Okay, ten out of ten. All right, the next thing we talk about is oh, no, I can't. I'm gonna reach for it. You know, I'm, just, I'm, I'm literally returning this. I don't care. This one is gonna set me over the fucking edge. It's gonna set me over, over the edge because I can't get over it. And. Someone like tried to explain to me in my last video like what it was about and I don't give a shit. I don't want an explanation. There's no excuse for it. This is the ugliest fucking water and I don't want any companies out there like reaching out to me and like telling me something. I don't give a fuck. Like you should get a new designer. It's ugly. 
Eternal Naturally Alkaline. It's, the brand is Eternal. This is the ugliest shape bottle. I don't even want to hold it. It looks like a goddamn gallbladder. It looks like some kind of a fucking organ that belongs in your body. It is the ugliest shape. First of all, why is the top bigger than the bottom? Okay. Like, oh, like I, I can't like, Oh my god, like it doesn't even look like a dick. It just looks like the ugliest fucking organ I've ever seen in my life. Who the fuck would buy this? And by the way, this is a small one. The big one is even more prevalent. Like I bought the small one because I didn't want to spend more money on the fucking big one. The big one is even fucking uglier and it's even more like readily available in stores. Like I see it everywhere. Why are people buying this for the supermarket? It's so ugly. Like even Ralph's carries this. It's fucking ugly. Where the fuck is this shit made? Shasta Trinity Alps, California. This is Walnut Creek, California. What the fuck is that? Oh yeah, it's like San Francisco. Pure and pristine water doesn't need to come from Fiji or France. It came right here from, yeah, from America. Fine, I like that. But why the fuck are you designing water bottles like this? Who okayed this? You guys have so much money to like make the coolest fucking water bottle ever. Make a 70s my water bottle, okay? Make it like cute dome shaped top or like a solid like my Sisley like my little Sisley like face cleaner that I shared with you guys this morning on Instagram with Heaven and Walked. Make it like that. It is, I would pay like I would probably pay like four three or four dollars a fucking water bottle for that because it's just fucking cute and I want it in my house. I cannot with this. Like and then they put like these swirls on the side. What the fuck is that? There's like more organs. There's like more organs on the side. Like there's like drawings of organs on the side. Like literally gallbladder. It's like I'm not. I don't know anatomy too well. Like I don't even know. It's like kidney, a kidney shape. No, kidney shape pool is kidney shape is like that. Yeah, no, that's not kidney. It looks like a fucking god. I don't know. Like an, an intestine. Yeah. Like if you have. Oh my god. It looks or a small your small intestine or your stomach. Is that what it is? I don't know. I'm not fucking joking. Like I hate it. I every time I go to get water, I see that. I'm like, if I was if I like Mr. Ralph's. If I was like Mr. Bristol Farms or whatever, I would never have that in my store. It is so ugly. Okay. Um, the next one I talk about is something I'm really depressed about. We know. <sighs> I'm blinking. Um, is Volvic. And I used to be a, a huge Volvic fan. Volvic, it just reminds me of like my first trips to like Europe when I was like a kid with my parents when we like to, you know, we went to like Germany and like France and like whatever, you know what I mean? Like we used to do like summer trips and um, oh, my phone is like blowing up. Okay, stop. And oh my God, it's so stupid. It became, you know, it's like, it's like so try hard, like, like trying to reach out to like the millennials who are like very like minimalistic and like don't want anything like extra, like driven, hashtag find your volcano. Like, what does that mean? It's stupid. Okay, anyway, it used to be so sick. It used to be so, like, Fr like French vacation. Like, you go to France and, like, you go into, like, their little, like, convenience stores and they have, like, Volvic there. Okay, I and the top was blue. Why the fuck is there a green top? I don't understand why you put a green top on water. What are you, like, fucking selling, like, some fucking mossy water? It's not appealing. It's not appetizing. This doesn't make me want to drink your water. I'm thinking, why is it green? That's what I'm thinking. Okay, then they fucking put this nasty fucking volcano, which I thought was, like, sand or like matcha like it's just so ugly okay i, I don't understand it I, I love the shape of the water bottle it's square it has a unique really wide top which i love like i want to drink when i want to drink water i don't want to drink water mm, like that i want to fucking drink water like i just had mexican food like i'm fucking hungover like give me some fucking water like i want it to be like a big ass top like that i fucking love it like they got it right there and like this is a cute size even i love their their bigger size more like that medium like chubby i love like a chubby thing it's so cute i have a sh chubby one to show you i love like a chubby bottle it's like cute it's different it's like like there was some effort put into it i don't know what it is but this is very cute but i won't i never purchased them ever anymore because of the green it's ugly i don't want a fucking green water bottle so they have like legitimately lost probably a thousand dollars a year none of that matters <laughs> for me a year it tastes so good it tastes good i hate water but it tastes good okay um Okay, the next thing I want to talk about is I have the Arrowhead thing. I'm so pissed about the Arrowhead thing. I will never buy Arrowhead again. It is such a fucking, like, it is so rude. It's so rude. It's, like, diabolical. It is, like, it, it's, like, deliberate to, like, 
fuck their customers over. Like they don't give a fuck about us. They are trying to save money. And they're try- first of all, they're trying to like, act like they're big eco, but they're not. They're just trying to save money. Let's be real, okay? They have made the they have made their water bottles so thin now. If you even touch it, it will like, squirt in your face. Like you'll make a fucking scene because like water went everywhere. Like you can't even hold it. I I need to like hold it by this and drink it like this. So that it doesn't like squirt in my goddamn face. It is an absolute worst situation ever. I am so sick of this crap with, with fucking Arrowhead. I hate it. Okay, so I got this one because there's a new sippy top situation that I wanted to share with you guys. First of all, this is the ugliest thing ever. Why is the top bigger than the bottom? It's just, it looks top heavy. What is this? Why? Why is the top bigger than the bottom? It should be like that. The bottom should be bigger than the top. Like, it's so weird. Just fucking like, it's like easy, easy math. It's like the bottom should be bigger than the top. It's like so, what the fuck is wrong with everyone? Okay. Oh, there's like a direction. There's like instructions for the cat. Stay back cat. Oh my God, please don't square everywhere. Oh, they improved it. Oh, so it like six cases. Actually, actually they've made it a little bit better. It was so bad before. Did you not fucking see that? I told you! I fucking told you! I told you! I fucking told you! So annoying! So annoying. Oh my god. Oh my god, it tastes like, it literally tastes like a public school. And I went to public school, so I can say it. It tastes like what they give you at like public school. Not like the cheapest shit ever, okay? That's what it tastes like. <clears throat> okay. Uh, I, bought, I brought this just to show you how thin it is. It's like so thin like it's look at this you can like look at that it's basically it's basically a plastic bag like basically a plastic fucking bag let's not fucking deny it you guys are putting water in plastic bags now shut the fuck up it's not eco you are saving half half of your plastics you're saving money you don't give a fuck about the environment just shut up okay don't say it's that don't it's about saving money okay i hate that bothers me so much water all over my fucking floor I'm like sweating underneath my legs. Underneath my, you know, like underneath my knees. I'm like sweating. I'm so hot. Okay. Um, my God. <laughs> Seriously, like I'm so annoyed. I can't do this water bottle thing again. I get, it gets like, I get really annoyed by it. Okay. I have a few more now. Um, I'm going to talk about a vibe one. This is really important to me. This is really important to me. And it has, you guys have to listen to this part. Okay. I understand we're all bougie bitches out there. I get it. Like we are and we like to like have vibes. All right. This is what you have to understand. Just stop. Please just stop it right now with the boss water. Stop it with any glass water bottle before I kill you. Like honestly, I'm going to strangle anyone out there who walks around with a boss water bottle or anything fucking glass from the supermarket. I'm not talking about your stupid reusable shit that I'm not mentioning right now. I'm talking about like ones that you buy from the supermarket that are glass and you just like carry around because you think you're the extra. Bitch, I don't care if you are like a fucking billionaire. I don't care if you're a billionaire. No one should or like has the audacity, should have the audacity to be buying glass water bottles. I want to tell you guys something. I bought this glass water bottle just to show you because it's so annoying and like outrageous. There was one there at the store I went to at Irwan, fucking annoying store. I hate that store. For seven dollars, seven dollars for a fucking water bottle because it was glass. Like, are you that pretentious where you're gonna like buy a seven dollar water bottle? Who I don't give a fuck if you are like, worth twenty five billion dollars. Like, you just look like a fucking tool. Okay. So I bought this one just to show you guys what I'm talking about. It's so cringe. Like, okay. But also, I just brought the Voss because I want to explain my, my, um, the Voss thing. Okay, so the Voss thing, I feel like it's only acceptable if you're, like, in a ho- at a hotel and they have, like, to provide Voss in your room or something. And I don't know why you would, like, take it out of your room. I feel like Voss water, like, shouldn't be removed from the bougie situation it was put in. Like, it shouldn't be, you shouldn't be walking around with it, okay? And it's, there's really no need for it. I understand, like, bougie hotels want to make their, like, place bougie or put the boss in there like I could never if I was like the owner I would never put it in like maybe the small boss water bottle is fine but it's just stupid okay that or you're like 
Voss, if you're like, on, I, I've never been on a, like, a private private plane, like private jet, but like if you're like on a private jet, and I can, I would imagine they would have like little Voss water bottles. You know what I mean? So if like you're getting off a private jet, and like you have, like you bring your water bottle, you're fine. Like that, like you know, it kind of like makes sense. Like I guess. But if you are the one to have purchased those to like cart around with yourself, there's something wrong with you. Like like the, the Voss doesn't taste as good as, as something else. Okay, so. I just hate it. I just think it's so pretentious. And if I see, ugh, like, cause I live in Brownwood, you know what I mean? Like, Brownwood's so snobby. I like, can't stand it. Like, I, like, I never leave my house. <laughs> well, I do, but like, I don't, I don't know anyone. Okay, so people like go to like people work out here. Like, I don't work out. Like, <laughs> I just don't like working out. So, um, and they're like, the my the workout classes here are like sixty dollars a class. It could be like more than that. Like, people here have like, a fucking lot of money. You know what I mean? Like, just blow. And I'm just shocked by that. Like, I'm, honestly, it's so, that's probably why I don't work out. Cause I'm not going to class. Like, I'm not, I refuse to pay. I refuse. I refuse to pay for my, I, after fucking, I'm so sick of it. What's that place with fucking shitty music that I like, went to and I was like paying money and I was like still fat? What is it called? What's up? That cycling place? Soul Cycle? Oh, yeah, Soul Cycle. Oh my God. <sighs> the music they play there is so bad. I would get so frustrated. If you guys follow my Instagram, you know what I'm talking about. I like couldn't even work out. I was like waiting for a song that I could like, that I could like, like what's the word jive to like like work with it, it was like why are I, oh I can't I just can't okay so anyway people around here are like super like bougie and like dumb like that you know what I mean and they, they're the kind of people who like carry this they like went to like a $70 like workout class probably more than that and they have their boss water bottles like shove it up your fucking ass like I just bleh, like stop oh my god like bitch you're not cool and actually make yourself look stupid okay so the next one I talk about is this, like, why would anyone purchase this? <sighs> like, it's the dumbest thing, it's so extra. It's the ugliest thing I've ever seen in my life, it is so try hard. Like, why would anyone purchase this? This is the dumbest shit. First of all, it's like stainless steel up here. It's like, this makes, it's like nails on a chalkboard. I hate it, I just bought it to show you guys, like, I don't know, they're like cringeworthy bottle was, so fucking cringeworthy. Um, there's nothing about this I like. It's just horrible. It, who, uh, but they do make a good one. This one I think is really cute. Same brand. It's a small little one. There's way too much writing on it. I think I talked about this in my last video too. The mouth is huge. You guys know I love a huge mouth. And it's cute. It's fine. The water tastes fine. But there's way too much water. Like way too much information on here. Bitch, you're a fucking water bottle. Shut your fucking mouth. Let me, let me, can I please read all this stupid shit they have on here? It's like you ruin your whole vibe. Like, I would never buy this. I'll never buy it because I'll never buy it because it's not it's not like clean. It's a fucking shit show. Make it fuddly by like writing all this stupid shit on it. Best for babies and expectant mothers. Why? Why? It's a fucking water bottle. <laughs> Natural electrolytes. Springs in protected area. Clean, pure taste, no aftertaste. Low mineral content. You, bitch, you think I'm gonna fucking turn around somewhere and like look at the fucking like, I, I do look sometimes for the sodium because you know like some of those like sparkling waters have sodium in it. Like bitch, I don't need any more sodium. Um, but like you think I'm gonna like, sit around here and like, like oh, 100% recyclable, PVA free water bottles, low mineral content. Like they wanna sit around and read that and try to judge which water, water, water I'm gonna buy? Shut up, okay? You're so fucking pretentious. You ruined your water bottle. It actually would have been really cute if you just left it clean. Just put your fucking whatever this. Aqua, I can't even fucking pronounce that. Just. Put your fucking ugly logo and that's it. No one needs to read any of that bullshit. No one cares. It's fucking water. They're only gonna buy it if it's a, if it's cute, decent priced water. That's it. They don't care about anything else. It's fucking water. I'm sweating. Okay, the last one we talk about is this. And I do love this water ball so much. We all know. It's hard to find. It's a big chubby one. It's a crystal crystal geyser. The chubby one, okay? I love it. It's cute. I cannot stand their small water bottles. And I hate the sippy top. It's that kind that you can't even get in your fucking mouth. Like, it is so, it's diabolical. It's diabolical. Like, how the fuck does this cunt expect me to drink this from here? Like, these assholes are laughing at us, I swear to God. Oh my God. I thought you were going to have enough of this. I've had enough of this. I can't even drink it. Oh my God, I'm going to ruin my mouth. I have to hold it like that. <laughs> I have to like hold it. It's so stupid. No, it tastes like public school too. I don't like it. Um, but I, whatever. I would buy this. When it's cold, it's, I think it's better. 
but I just like the way it like looks. I don't know. It's just cute. Okay. So I'm going to go, I want to make sure I didn't forget anything because this is like really, really important to me. So we get the vibe. So let me just tell you which ones like we're allowed to carry. First of all, the thing is like I, the whole carrying on the water bottle thing, like I really hate it. I don't understand it. I don't like think that it's necessary. Like bitch, you are not that thirsty. Okay. You don't have to carry around a water bottle. Anyone who carries around a water bottle to me is a weirdo. Like, you're a weirdo. Like, what are you like? What are you like? Camping somewhere? I don't understand why I can't water bottle. I don't drink water, so I don't get it. Like, and I don't really care. I just feel like here in America, if you're that thirsty, you can get water somewhere. You don't have to fucking like carry on a water bottle. Shut the fuck up. You know what I also like? I like that. I love the Aquapana brand, but I couldn't find it in the glass bottle. I actually do like that one for a tablescape because it tastes really good. I got it like on sale recently and I was actually really impressed. Um, if I get a table, if you're gonna like set up a table for yourself, because like we don't like friends, right? <laughs> okay. Um, what was I talking about? I just want to like go through and talk about yeah, the water. That's why I don't understand. Like, the water bottle thing is annoying because I don't get it. Like, it's stupid. Like you're carrying it around. I, I, you know what I mean. I feel like the only one that's if you're gonna carry it around, if you have to carry something around. <sighs> Like, if I, if I saw you guys carrying, an, like, an arrowhead around, I'd be, like, afraid you're gonna, like, spill water on me, I swear. Like, I'd, like, run. I swear to God. Like, you saw what happened to me. I got fucking murdered by water. I hate water. Like, when, I feel like when I drink water, I feel like I'm drowning. Like, I don't, I, I don't like it. Like, I, it's, there's something about it. Like, it makes me feel like I'm drowning when I'm drinking water. Like, I don't, I don't love the way it, like, I don't know. Okay. Um, I'm just trying to think, like, which one. I just love this one. But I just hate that it's green. Like, I feel like it's so cute. So I could never anymore. I'm really depressed about it. I could never anymore. This one's like a little bit too big. I mean, I don't know. I just wouldn't like carry around like water. Like, it's really sad. It's too big. Uh, yeah, no, the gallbladder is absolutely fucking not. Evian, this is only for table scapes. And I hate that word too. It's for, like when you set up table. Um, glass water bottles. Oh, it's so embarrassing. We're just scooting over there. This one has way too much writing on it. There's nothing. We have, I have nothing for you. I have nothing. I guess like the Whistler one, but it's just too big. This one's like cute. It's the cutest one. Should I throw it in your bag? I guess that's the cutest one. It just has more of a vibe to it. You see what I mean? Like they don't irritate me with all their writing. There's not too much. There's a lot of writing on the back, but it's like not... This one's like trying to show, I can't, I can't sit over an hour and explain, explain it. It's like, this is like trying to show off. Like, the, it, oh my God. It's like, I don't know. It's like, it's your fucking water. Your water. Like, shut up. Okay. I think I'm done. Um, yeah. Okay. I'm done. I think I'm done. <laughs> All right, you guys. Did you like this? I know that we need to do like an updated one. So, um, Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I'm like sitting here trying to decide if there's something else I need to talk about or not. Besides the fact that I need to like go re-blow dry this area. I feel like it's kind of a fucking mess. I don't know. <sighs> okay guys. Oh. Yeah? Okay, we're done, I guess. Okay, bye.